Welcome to another fly tying tutorial by Fish Base Fly Box. Tonight I'm going to tie the Cave Lake Special. What I have in the vise is a Diachi 2220 size 8 and a glass bead for the head. I'm using UTC 70 fluorescent search shoes thread and I'm just started at the head and I'm just going to bring it back to the bend of the hook and bring it back to about the point of the hook. I'm tie again. And I'm going to take four strands of peacock pearl and I'm going to tie those in. I want the uh, tail to be about a shank length long. So I'll take it and measure it and, and then just tie it in. And we'll cut these ends off. And at this point, I'm going to take. I got two pieces of, uh, you're supposed to use olive, I like to use fluorescent chartreuse crystal flesh. And I'm going to take and just tie those in at the top of the, to start it off with, top there, secure it down, I'm going to bring them and just kind of make it so they wrap around the hook shank. And wrap that back to the bend of the hook there. And then I'll take it and I'll cut the, I'm, you can't see it, but I'm taking, I'm just measuring that crystal flash and I'm cutting it at the length of the tail. And from here I'm going to take some what I've got here is some olive not olive peacock um, I guess a peacock chenille and I'm just gonna you don't need very much of this at all. So I'm just gonna take and tie that in Strip the some of the fibers off of there and tie it in at the head of the fly here. I'm going to have to uh, back, bend the hook here. And then all you're going to do is you're just going to do one wrap of this around the hook shank. So, right there. Take, tie it down. I'm going to cut that away from the hook. And now I'm going to take some ice yarn. This is a uh, peacock olive-ish type color. Um, the exact color is golden olive. And I'm going to take and just tie that down right through there. Get all the fibers down, and then I'll bring the um, thread to the bend of the hook there. And I want to take and wrap this, so I'll probably I'm gonna do a half hitch here and put it on my bobbin cradle. I'm gonna take and just wrap that ice yarn around the body. Nice tight wraps. You see the shimmer that fly gives it, that that ice yarn gives a fly. I'm going to tie that off. Three wraps there. You don't want to go all the way to the head, you want to leave a little space there for some more um, Palmer chenille. What I've got here is some medium Palmer chenille fluorescent uh, chartreuse. You see it's a little, not quite as long as others. And I'm going to just take and tie that in. Go to the head of the fly. And then I'm just going to wrap it and palm, make sure it's palmer back there. Just do a few wraps there. And then tie it down. Like so, cut the Palmer chenille out, and then I'm going to pull those fibers back a little bit and secure a small head there. And then I'll take my whip finish, and we're going to whip finish the fly. And 
And then I'm just going to cut the thread. And you can apply some uh, head cement in there. I'm going to use some Sally Hansen's Hard as Nails. I'll bodkin to put it all in place. And there it is. The original recipe calls for a few different items. Um, it asks for monofilament for the thread. I don't understand why entirely why I use monofilament when I could just use chartreuse um, thread. So anyway, there it is, the Cave Lake Special. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please remember to like to like Fishbait's Flybox on Facebook, to subscribe to Lance Dean's YouTube channel and to stay up to date by subscribing to fishbaseflybox.com. Thank you.